Senor Yor, it's your boy YG, and we are back with some more of the JD Davidson, my career. And if you skipped over the first part of the video, man, make sure you guys go to the community tab and vote on how you guys want me to proceed with the Jaden Ivy, my career. I know it just kind of stopped all of a sudden, but there was a good reason, and I explained that further on the community tab. Either way, today JD Davidson is in the starting lineup for the Chicago Bulls, and unfortunately, it's because our starting point guard Lonzo Ball is actually out. He's day to day with shin splints, but that's okay. We're going to pick up where my boy is lacking and hopefully we can show the Chicago Bulls organization that they did not waste this pick on JD and we can just step in and fill the role that Lonzo had. Yes, sir. You see them boys getting ready. We got a new leader tonight. Oh, Lord. It's against Milwaukee. Yes, sir, JD. I like the confidence, my boy. You see the lineup chat, and I did not know that the debut for JD to start was going to be against the Bucks. Man. But either way, sing it for me one time. Jump ball, get it, get it. Jump ball, get it, get it. Jump ball, Lord. Man, if you had to choose a team to be your first game to go against as a starter, you definitely would not choose this team right here because uh, on paper, their defense is unmatched in the NBA, which means on Hall of Fame, it's even worse. But you can't tell from the rookie's performance right now. I'm talking about he's scoring bike to bike to bike. Hold on. I'm trying to do something like this. Okay, throw up that trash. I'm going to go get it. And in the first quarter, everything just seemed so great for, for my boy JD. As you see, dunking on Giannis, that's a feat that most people who are seasoned veterans can't even do. Ten parts for my boy JD, and the game just started. Like like I said, my boy is, is multifaceted. Like, he can score. He can assist. Like, it, it is what it is. And look at this. And one right there from Vucci trying our best to stay into this game. And unfortunately, a harsh realization for the Chicago Bulls is if we cannot beat Milwaukee, then it's a high chance you will not see these boys winning a conference championship or making their way to the finals, right? And this is why, bro. Look at these goofies going crazy. Goofy number one, Giannis Antetokounmpo, <laughs> is literally just going off. And then you got Hassan Whiteside. It's pretty much the same issue that we had in the first episode, like the boys are not fighting for the rebound. They just giving up easy points in the paint. Like, foul somebody, bro. Don't make it too easy. And then things like that, doink. Like, what's going on, bro? I mean, Giannis is one thing. Like, I'm not really expecting anybody on our team to stop Giannis head up. No, but the help defense and like, like this right there, incorrect help defense. Why would you leave somebody wide open? And it's a two, bro. Guys, three points are worth more than two. It's simple math. And, of course, Chicago gets slaughtered at Chicago. My God, 113 to 63 is the final score. And make sure you guys look at this box score, bro. The star players, 0 for 7, 0 for 4, Taco 0 for 3. Like, we need some help out here, bro, drastically. Oh, Lord, look who rolling in the town. If you thought Milwaukee was going to be a doozy, bro, <laughs> wait till you see this. And we're going to jump right into it. Lonzo is back from injury, so my boy, JD, is filling back in in his role, coming off the bench, being that fire off the bench that the boys need. And so far, it's looking like this role is perfect for JD until the Chicago Bulls team is ready to help my boy when it's time for him to actually take over the starting position. Right now, it's 32 to 28. Never mind making 32 to 30. My boy Taco getting some in. Look at Caruso attacking the rim. And this is what we were missing in against the Milwaukee Bucks. Like, where was this during the Milwaukee game? Now they want to take it all out on the Golden State Warriors. Hold on. That looks very familiar. I like that. 46 to 60, bro. <laughs> and that's how we're starting the second quarter, bro. I guess Lonzo is really the missing piece for Chicago. Look at the lobs. Like, come on, bro. Hold on. Pull up with that. Bang. 
yeah this team is looking phenomenal bro and i feel like this is kind of what happened irl with the chicago bulls alonzo was injured and it just seemed like the whole team crumbled bro and that's crazy how one person really can mess up the whole puzzle piece for the team but it also makes sense right we need all of the puzzle pieces and, and it all needs to fit it all needs to make sense patrick williams with a three-pointer and believe it or not especially compared to the first game it's 73 to wait a minute <laughs> not the 360 yo boy y'all singing with me 360 jc y'all don't know about it y'all ain't up on the wave game y'all don't know what's going on out here <laughs> 105 to 129 three minutes and 21 seconds left in the fourth would you have thought like after seeing the chicago bulls get slaughtered by milwaukee you probably thought they was about to get slaughtered by golden state again look at steph pulling out all of the tricks trying his best to make this score look respectable but unfortunately i'm sorry steph it's a little bit too late for you to catch on fire baby and y'all let me know down below in the comment section again who do you guys have winning the nba finals man i'm of course a steph curry fan so i'm rude for golden state and uh yeah we'll see but i'm also a jason tatum fan too so i'm kind of I, I just want it to be a good series no injuries things of that nature and this game is winding down and look at the pass the sonamu i hope that's how you pronounce his name but the boy got the scrap on him chat one wait hold on before i say the score <laughs> 118 to 139 is the final score but i hope you guys are enjoying this series man if you are make sure you guys leave it a thumbs up subscribe turn on post notifications if you are new to the channel and you want to see some more nba 2k content just like this and i got you guys but until the next one man peace who did this to you soldier ah! who did this to you soldier superman superman ah, it hurts <laughs> oh my chest bang <laughs> yeah right into it i know y'all missed him and now you see why he's on medical leave right now shoot with a tough shot and like I said, these are the last two games of the reg season. And the Reggie is over. You heard me. It's time to get into the Geico Nationals. And you see the Cedar Valley Bears are at tip top shape. Man, you love it. Boys is playing defense. I'm going to miss this team when, when Shu goes to college or wherever he going to go. Oh, my Lord. Throw it. Dying, baby. Wearing them James hardest. You can hardly believe. Never mind. I ain't going to do it. Y'all not ready for the metaphors. Just say that right here. Pump fake.